Hi guys, Karen here with another video. Welcome back to our channel. Thank you so much for watching. So today, as you can see, I thought I'd take you along with me as I uh, run through Target. <laughs> so I'm here today. I'm wasting a little bit of time. I'm uh, waiting on Maya to be done with one of her classes. So I thought I would come here and meander around the store. You know, that's... um one thing that i really enjoy and more than that i really like scent i really enjoy candles and um target has some really good candles and they're not super expensive but they have a they have a really good throw in terms of the scent and how far the scent travels throughout the house so i i'm obsessed with the scent so it's almost fall and so I come here to grab my candles for fall time are any of you all addicted to candles like I am um, this is my other guilty pleasure um, and I try to get I saw these last weekend sorry I'm smelling them all in your faces um, <laughs> and they had some they put out some really good scents i was wondering why they were clearing the shelves now i know because they have they have some really good um candles this season this one is really good guys the cashmere vanilla smells so good and i just decided to get the smaller one because it was ten dollars so this one is definitely coming with me and then i moved over to the magnolia section um this is where I think um, they have a, sh they used to have a show on HGTV. I think it's still there. Um, Fixer Upper, I believe. Correct me if I'm wrong. And now they have the Magnolia Channel and they sell candles and things here at Target. And oh, these candles smell really, really good. And I love the tin that they're in. Um, just different types of candles some candles like one of the candles is entitled herb the candle in my hand that i'm just putting down are different types of uh, lemon basil and whatnot um just really nice candles and overall i really like this area because you can find some pretty unique pieces up here they have the um uh, room sprays as well as the um diffusers so I'm just looking around. Um, this is where I found, and they have cake stands too. This is where I found the um, uh, measuring cup, the glass measuring cup. That was really cool. They have some vases over here as well. Um, I, I have the salt container, not the pepper. And they have lots of very unique items. I just found this one, it's $7.99. And at first I didn't know what it was, but then I noticed it's a cheese grater. And let me tell you, laugh at me if you will, but um, I know Maya likes to grate her cheese. And this, if you grate the cheese, it goes right into this little wooden container. And so you don't have to worry about it going all over the place. So that's pretty cool. So I put that in the cart. And like I said, they have candles all over in this area cake stands, wooden bowls. Um, I'm back over here at the candles. I am one of those people who have to go back to things. So right here they have, the bigger candles are $20. The smaller ones, some of them are 10, some of them are $7.99. So um, I wanted the one that's called Herb, but they don't have it in the size that I'm looking for which is fine. So I'm just going through all of the candles um, and collecting the ones that I want to take with me. But right now I think I'm pretty set on the autumn scents. Um, and remember, if you want the scent of like rosemary or whatnot, you can also create a water, um, a water uh, potpourri and you just take your herbs and put it into a pot turn the pot on to low or actually about two um, or medium heat low to medium heat and uh, it'll smell up the whole area I promise 
especially if you use rosemary peppermint this is really cute i was looking at that because it's a container for tea for like your dry tea but then i was thinking you know how long will the tea sit in there and you know um i'd have to clean it out between each dry tea so i was thinking maybe not quite for me and then i saw the dish towels over here um I, I like towels. I tried to collect the towels for the kitchen, the, um, the towels that you dry things with, as well as the washcloths. Um, these look cute, but I'm not sure if they will, you know, how well they'll, they will fare, excuse me. And then I saw these, um, and I thought they were pretty cute, you know, with the holidays coming up. I was also looking at the artwork. I was surprised to find the artwork here at this particular Target. So I did stop to check it out. Um, you know, they had some interesting pieces and um, and I'm not used to seeing artwork at Target, not, not artwork that I'm interested in, but I was like, whoa, okay. You know, I had to do a double take. I was like, oh, this is so cool. Um, is anyone else? like to collect mugs i enjoy mugs and um i always hit up this section to see what they've put out are there any new mugs you know for the fall and winter season coming up i like to have one or two new ones um maya is suggesting some glass mugs this season so you know and these bottles are my favorite although i could not find the price um, and I was running a little bit behind on time, <laughs> so I could not stop, but those are some of my favorites. I was trying, if it was $5, I would have snatched it up, but it was an actual, it was a different bottle. And those are pretty neat. You can use them for anything. Once again, they had a lot of wooden bowls, some mason jars over here. I like the Wex jars and mason jars as well. Lots of interesting and unique things. I think this I already have this bowl. Um, and they have lots of different cutting boards. I thought that was pretty neat. With This one had marble on it. Um, and just lots of little pictures. Uh, it still didn't have the price on it. So we had to part ways. <laughs> and it's so cute, the cutting board. But last but not least, I had to hit up the towel section once again to see how these washcloths are. I normally get the washcloths at Crate and Barrel, um, but the dry towels I tried to find anywhere where I can get dry towels for the kitchen that really dry the dishes. And sometimes the, the washcloths and dry towels are cute and fun colors, but they don't really dry properly or they leave lots of uh, bits and pieces from the towel on the dishes themselves. So I'm a little selective. Let me know in the comments, are any of you like me? Um, and these are the, the, there were five in this set. They felt really good, but they didn't feel like they were going to dry the things. Let me know um, your thoughts on the, the towels that you use for the kitchen and where you get them from, I might have to check that out. And then last but not least, I always uh, come to the uh, sheets section, um, pillow, sheets, bedding, um, because I'm always trying to uh, pick some up to make sure that we're always stocked for when our family members come home for the holidays, especially around this time. Everybody kinds of, you know, come, comes home uh, for Thanksgiving, Christmas time. Uh, so I hope you guys found this video helpful. Let me know what you think in the comments below and we'll see you in the next one. Bye.